New from overnight, Youngstown Police's homicide caseload got even bigger. One man is dead, another is in the hospital after a shooting. Now, this is where it happened on the city's east side. This is on the corner of Bennington Avenue and Stewart Avenue. Now, 27 First News reporter Dan Marcel is at the police station working to get more information. He joins us live with what we've learned so far. Dan. Molly, we've got some new information this half hour. Uh, Lieutenant Doug Babovnik of the Youngstown Police Department informed me that the second victim is in stable condition right now after he sustained several gunshot wounds. The other victim in this shooting on Youngstown's east side died from his injuries. It all happened just at a little earlier than 2 o'clock this morning. Uh, police say that it happened on the intersection of Bennington and Stewart. They found the car in a field. Now, right now, police are still trying to piece together exactly what happened. This marks another homicide in Youngstown, the ninth in the last 35 days and the 21st this year in the city. Right now, police say they have no suspects in the case, and they are also not saying whether or not this latest homicide is related to any of the others that have happened in the last month or any other violent crime this year. We're going to continue to follow this case and bring you more information as we continue to get it. Stick with WKBN as we continue to get that new information. For now, outside the Youngstown Police Department, Dan Marcel, WKBN 27 First News, Sunday morning.